Mr. President, you asked to see me. I know you're busy. What do you need, sir? Sir, I want to give you a word of warning. Sir, I don't know what you heard, but whatever it is, Jefferson started it. Thomas Jefferson resigned this morning. You're kidding. I need a favor. Whatever you say, sir, Jefferson will pay for this behavior. Talk less. I'll use the press. I'll write under a pseudonym. You'll see what I can do to him. I need you to draft an address. Yes, he resigned. You can finally speak your mind. No. He's stepping down so he can run for president. Yeah. Good luck defeating you, sir. I'm stepping down. I'm not running for president. I'm sorry, what? One last time. Relax, have a drink with me one last time. Let's take our break tonight, and then we'll teach him how to say goodbye. To say goodbye, you and I. No, sir. I'd like to talk about neutrality, sir. With Britain and France on the verge of war, is this the best I want? I want against partisan fighting. Pick up a pen, start writing. I want to talk about what I have. You could continue to serve the last time. The people will hear from me one last time. And if we get this right, we're going to teach them how to say goodbye. You and I. Mr. President, you will say you're weak. No, they will see we're strong. Safe in the nation we've made. I want to sit under my own vine and fig tree, a moment alone in the shade. At home in this nation we've made. One last time. One last time. Though, in reviewing the incidents of my administration, I am unconscious of intentional error, I am nevertheless too sensible of my defects not to think it probable that I may have committed many errors. I shall also carry with me the hope that my country will view them with indulgence, and that after 45 years of my life dedicated to its service, with an upright zeal, the faults of incompetent ability will be consigned to oblivion. As I myself will soon be to the nations of the rest. I anticipate with pleasing and expectation that retreat in which I promise myself to realize the sweet joy of partaking in the midst of my fellow citizens. The benign influence of a good laws of the free government, the ever favorite object of my heart, and the happy reward as I trust. For mutual care, labors and dangers. One last time.